How to make your penis bigger 6 to 9 inches naturally without pills. Important notice. If you want to increase your penis size fast, then you have to understand penis enlargement with only exercise takes time. However, you can combine penis exercises routine with a scientifically proven method called stem cell growth to boost up penis growth. With the help of stem cell therapy, you can transfer more of these types of cells in your penis. Tom Kandau has created a video and a quiz that will determine how long your penis can grow with stem cell therapy. If you don't have time and want results quickly, I recommend you to watch stem cell therapy video. Otherwise, you can follow my penis exercise routine below to increase your penis using your hands and lubricant only. Hello everyone, I'm going to show you how to get a bigger penis and use your penis as a tool to shape your body and at the same time, add some inches to its thickness and its length. Yes, you are going to find out some great methods on how to increase your penis size that you are looking for some time. These methods will help you achieve a stronger and healthier penis. Many people have already used these methods to get a big penis and athletic muscles. Good news is, your penis and muscles hold same functions and purpose that is growing and enlarging. That is the reason your muscle and penis, due to their natural abilities, require exercises and nutrition to grow stronger, longer, and thicker. Penis becomes erect by absorbing blood into its spongy chambers. Thankfully, these chambers can grow and become bigger with the help of proper exercise routine. There are around 50 exercises that can increase penis size, but don't worry, you don't need to practice all of them. I'm going to show you only a few exercises that can help you achieve results quickly. Exercises that I'm going to share with you on this website will suit your body, and by performing them for 10 to 15 minutes a day, you will see growth in your penis size in a couple of weeks. However, it's important to stick with these exercises to see results. Some of these exercises you can perform while taking a daily shower. Additionally, I'm going to share some nutrition tips and mental strategy that help you to achieve your goals efficiently and effectively. Therefore, if you are having a concern about your penis size, here you are going to find healthy and safe methods to gain an athletic body and larger penis at the same time. Okay, let's start talking about how to make the penis grow. Measuring Penis Size Before starting penis enlargement exercise, you have to measure your penis both in flaccid state and erect state. Also, you need to keep a logbook to track your gains. While measuring your penis, you need to round down your measurements. This way, when you see gain, you will not think it's because you didn't measure correctly. Measure your penis size once a month. If you measure your penis every day, it will lead to inaccurate results, and it will become harder to motivate yourself. Measure the flaccid length. Many things, including temperature, can dictate flaccid penis length. However, people often see the first gain in their flaccid length while performing penis enlargement exercises. To keep the measurement standardized, we have certain methods for measuring the flaccid length of the penis. To measure your penis accurately, measure from the side of your penis. Stand straight and extend your flaccid penis in front of your penis so that your penis will become parallel to the ground. Place the ruler next to your penis slightly pressing the pubic bone. The ruler and your penis should be parallel to the ground. Measure the tip of the penis head and record the measurement in inches or centimeters or millimeters, whichever you are more comfortable with. The important thing is always to measure your penis and don't change measurement unit. Measure the erect length. Most people looking for how to increase penis length are interested in increasing their erect length. Again, the best way is to measure your penis from the side of your penis. Most researchers use erect length to calculate the average penis size that's around 6 inches to 6.25 inches. To calculate the erect length of your penis, you first need to gain 100% erection where you feel you reach the maximum erection. Hold your penis with one hand and place the ruler next to it with the other hand. Make sure you should be pressing the ruler slightly against the pubic bone. Measure the closest millimeter next to the tip of your penis head and make sure you don't exaggerate the measurement. It's recommended to round down your measurement. Your penis erect length measurement should be from the base to the tip of the penis head. Measure the flaccid girth. Girth is the most difficult to measure because people have different girth readings depending on the part where they are taking girth measurement. The most standard way is to measure girth from the middle of the penis shaft. Hold your penis out in front of you and wrap measuring tape around your penis. Make sure you don't pull the measuring tape too hard. Pull it to a reasonable level and remember the amount of pull for the next time you measure. The average flaccid girth size is around 3 inches to 4 inches. Measure your penis flaccid penis girth and note the measurement. Measure the erect girth. Before taking this erect girth measurement, you should make sure your penis is at 100% erect. Hold the penis with one hand so it is parallel to the ground. Use the other hand to wrap the tape around the penis, but don't pull it too tightly. 
Usually, average erect girth is around 4.5 to 5 inches. Measure the erect girth around the penis and note down the measurement. Tracking your gains. The reason you are looking for how to get a larger penis is you want to see some extra inches in your penis. Therefore, it makes sense to track your progress. You can use the below table to track your progress and update these measurements after every four to six weeks. By tracking your progress, you will remain motivated and see results that you were hoping for. How to prepare yourself before each penis exercise. Here are a few important things you need to keep in your mind before starting any penis exercise. It's important to stimulate yourself so that testosterone level and your mental concentration on your genital region increases. Keep your pubic hair short to improve the handling of your penis and help with sanitation. For lubrication, don't use any oil-based chemical or artificial-based lubricants, such as petroleum jelly, baby oil, Vaseline, and other cleaning agents. Try to use natural lubricants that are suitable for your penis. Never start penis exercises right after ejaculation. Because your testosterone level is low after ejaculation and your connective tissues are beginning to tighten. Before engaging in any penis exercise, it is important to warm up your penis using a hot water soaked towel or warm water. Also, start with light and soft exercises to avoid any injuries to your penis. Important factors about penis enlargement. Drink at least 8 glasses of filtered water and include pure natural fruit juice as much as possible. Avoid drinking energy drinks, cola, and artificial fruit juices as they contain too much sugar that is bad for humans. Try to eat low-fat and high-fiber diet. Include organic foods such as vegetables and fruits as much as possible. Avoid junk foods, processed foods, canned foods, artificial sweeteners, and above all, avoid smoking at all costs. Drink alcohol in moderation. Some vitamins and mineral supplements can provide good blood flow into the penis. You can include these vitamins, minerals, and amino acids in your diet, but keep them in moderation. Mental relaxation and peace of mind are two very important factors for maintaining and developing sexual organs and sex hormones. Avoid stress as much as possible by engaging in activities that bring some meaning to your life and surround yourself with good people. Include 15 to 30 minutes of cardio exercises or lifting exercises in your daily routine as they can enhance your stamina, reduce fat storage, decrease blood clots, and improve blood circulation. Exercises keep the body stronger and healthier. You can boost the effectiveness of penis exercises by combining them with stem cell therapy. Don't worry, it's a simple and easy process that you can find inside Penis Enlargement Remedy. Penis Enlargement Exercise So far, we've talked about internal matters that can help in changing body chemistry and improving sexual health. This process is going to take time, as this is not an overnight process. This process will take time as you practice them and start getting results from them. That's fine for some people, but for others, they need quick results. If you are also one of the men who want to see quick results, then you need to include penis enlarging exercise in your daily routine. I'm trying my best to provide every solution for how to get a bigger penis with exercises on this website, and now it's up to you if you want to practice these penis exercises or not. These penis exercises are safe, and if you perform them according to the instruction mentioned below, then you can avoid any injury and see some quick results. Beginners will see results in as little as 2-3 to three weeks, but as you progress, results will come slowly. The warm-up exercise. Before starting any other penis exercise, there is something you need to do to increase your chances of getting results quickly, and that is a warm-up exercise. Warm-up exercise is very simple. All you need to do is immerse your penis in hot, warm water for 8 to 10 minutes. You can accomplish this by holding your penis under the faucet of the bathtub. Holding for more than 10 to 12 minutes might be a little bit of a stretch. Therefore, it's better to take a long, hot bath. Soaking your penis under hot, warm water not only relaxes you, but it also encourages a great flow of blood into your genital region, especially the penis. The main objective of the warm-up exercise is to increase the blood flow to the penis. And that is what you want before starting penis exercise. If you have a good diet, then your penis will be full of nutrient-rich blood that grows quickly. The cool-down exercise. After completing your exercise session, it is good to end your session with a brief soak of 10 minutes. You have to begin with warm water, and then gradually lower the temperature after every couple of minutes until the temperature reaches slightly lower than room temperature. This method is surprisingly effective for penis enlargement, as it will not only relax you, but it will reduce discomfort or swelling you may feel by stretching the soft tissues of your penis. Just like any other exercise, you will feel a little bit of discomfort initially. Doesn't matter if you start with stretching exercise or jelking exercise. In case if you feel discomfort the next day, don't increase the intensity. 
If it's too much discomfort in your last penis exercise session, then try to decrease the intensity of your exercise routine slightly. Remember, the goal is growth, not pain. A little bit of discomfort is normal, but make sure you don't hurt yourself. The injury will not take you anywhere, and you will not achieve your goal. Basic Stretching Before revealing the steps of stretching, it's important to understand how it helps in increasing penis size. Your penis is not a bone or muscle. Instead, it is a span of spongy tissue filled with pockets that collect blood. This spongy tissue is known as corpora cavernosa. When you stretch your penis, you are stretching this spongy tissue to make its pocket larger, allowing more blood to fill into the penis during an erection. And this will allow more blood into the penis during erection, that means longer and stronger erection. Before starting stretching, the first thing you need to consider carefully is lubrication. You're putting your penis under paces, and you don't want to hurt it. We highly recommend water-based lubricants as they are more efficient and easy to clean as compared to oil-based lubricants that are messy and take a good enough time to clean. Stretching includes six different types of stretches, intermixed with masturbation to keep the penis fully erect. These six stretches are straight out in front of you, straight down, straight up, hard left, hard right, rotate and full circle. To start the stretching, you have to create an OK using your thumb and index finger with whatever hand you are going to use for stretching. Wrap your thumb and index finger just below the penis head. Start by stretching out your penis in front of you. Make sure you stretch firmly, not hard, as it will cause pain, and hold the stretch for 30 minutes. Then, move to your next stretch. Make sure your penis is fully erect while performing these stretches because the blood into the penis will contain all the nutrients that help in natural growth. Stretching used for allowing spongy tissue corpora cavernosa to hold more blood during the erection. After completing your first stretch for the 30-second interval, your erection may start fading. Quickly masturbate your penis to gain 100% erection before moving to the next stretch. In one exercise session, you have to do 3 reps, but not more than 5 reps of each stretch. Doing more than 5 reps in an exercise session will create pain and increases the risk of injury. Remember, penis enlargement is not a sprint, it is a marathon. You have to do these exercises regularly to see results. Once you complete 3 to 5 reps of each stretch, then reward yourself with ejaculation if you want. Otherwise, controlling your ejaculation will improve your sexual stamina that comes in handy on your special night with a special girl. Basic Jelking If you want to know how to make your penis thicker, then jelking is the perfect solution for you. Jelking is also known as milking. The major drawback of stretching exercise is, it focuses only on increasing the length of the penis, which messes up the total proportion of the penis. Yes, stretching helps in making the penis longer, but girth of your penis will remain unchanged. Some people only want to increase their penis length, but in most cases, people want to increase length and girth as well. You have to make sure your penis grows larger and thicker as well. This jelking technique is not a new age technique. Instead, men are using this technique for many decades to increase their penis size. In fact, jelking is the technique that used by men in every culture from all over the world. Jelking technique takes time. But if you're willing to put your efforts and dedication in this exercise, then you will see the result with this exercise. Similar to stretching exercise, lubrication is vital here. We recommend you to use water-based lubrication instead of oil-based lubricants because it's easy to clean water-based lubricant. Just like stretching exercise, jelking exercise also requires you to wrap an OK sign with your thumb and index finger around just below the penis head. However, in jelking exercise, you have to wrap your penis with OK sign using thumb and index finger at the base of the penis, and slowly moving your hand to the penis head in a steady stroke. You need to masturbate yourself until your penis reaches semi-erect state. Then, apply enough force to push the blood towards the penis head and keep it there. Start from the base, perform a firm squeeze, but not too firm, to move your hand from base to the head of the penis, like the motion you create for milking a cow. This motion should be slow and steady, taking approximately 3 seconds to complete. Switch your hands after completing the first stroke. If you're using the right hand to complete the first stroke, then switch to your left hand, then again back to the right, and so on. During these motions, you will see your penis head getting expand as more blood fills in the penis head. Do at least 20 reps of this jelking exercise in one exercise session a day. Try to increase reps after every exercise session, but at any point if you feel too much uncomfortable, then stop immediately. Consider these two exercises as the beginning exercise for at least a month. Try to perform them daily and increase reps as you progress. However, if you feel uncomfortable, then lower the intensity or stop doing it immediately if you start feeling too much pain. Once you complete these beginning exercises for at least a month, then switch to the advanced exercises for stretching and jelking. You can use stem cell therapy method as well. 
It is one of the scientifically proven non-surgical methods to increase penis size. You will start noticing results quickly when you combine these two penis exercises with stem cell therapy. Advanced Stretching Number 1 – Big 10 This exercise will take 20 minutes to complete. You have to start with the same warm-up routine as you did while performing the basic exercise. After completing the warm-up, sit down and extend one leg as much as possible. It would be difficult for you to extend for full 10 minutes, so sit down and prop your leg up on something. Reach down to grip your penis with the full hand instead of just the index finger. Grip your penis just below the head of the penis with your full hand. That will allow you to stretch straight out away from your body. In the beginning, you will feel uncomfortable. Hold this position for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, you have to do another round of warming up, and then lift your other leg and repeat the exercise. This stretch is enough, and you don't need to perform six different types of stretches mentioned above. These two 10-minute reps are more than enough. After the end of this 20-minute exercise, you have to spend time cooling down. Once the exercise is over, your dick is going to be sore. Cooling down will minimize swelling. Advanced Stretching Number 2 – Whole Hand Stretch This exercise is an advanced modification to the simple stretching exercise. Instead of using the index finger to wrap around your penis head, you will be using your hand wrap around your penis just below the penis head. After warming up, properly apply lubricant to your penis and hold the penis. Begin stretching exactly the same way you did the basic stretching exercise. Straight out in front of you, straight up, straight down, hard right, hard left. Rotate in full circle. Similar to basic stretching, begin by stretching your penis straight out in front of you. Make sure you don't stretch too hard as it will cause pain. Hold this position for 30 seconds before switching to the next stretch. You have to make sure to keep your penis fully erect while performing these stretches. Stretching exercise will help your penis to grow naturally. After holding your penis for 30 seconds, if you feel your erection is fading away, you have to masturbate to gain full hardness before switching to the next stretch. Don't do more than 3 reps of each 6 stretches in a single day. If you do more than 5 reps of every stretch, you will only be risking your penis for injury. After completing 3 reps of 6 stretches, you're done for the day. Advanced Stretching Number 3 – Girth Squeeze as you already know, the biggest drawback of stretching exercise is it increases penis length and does nothing to penis girth. We all know girth matters as well. That is why this stretching variation is designed to solve this problem. To begin this exercise, all you have to do is warm up until you gain semi-erection. Place your penis on the table or any hard surface and push your penis downward with the palm of your hand. The main aim here is to maintain firm and steady pressure for several minutes around 3 minutes and not more than 5 minutes. This firm pressure will accomplish what basic stretching does and also increases the width of your penis. The blood will flow to the outer edge of the penis and fill it with chemicals that promote growth. Once you complete three reps, perform cooling down exercise. Keep in mind, cooling down is important as far as advanced exercises are concerned, as they will put stress on the soft tissue. Advanced, jelking number one, two-handed jelk. Just like any other advanced exercise, this exercise also starts with warm-up exercise and ends with cool-down exercise. You have to masturbate to make sure you are hard or nearly hard. In the basic jelk exercise, you hold your penis with one hand and use your second hand to stroke. However, in this exercise, you're going to use your one hand wrapped at the base of the penis. This hand doesn't move. The sole purpose of this hand is to trap blood in your penis. Before starting this exercise, make sure you wait for 30 seconds to trap a lot of blood. Then, use your second hand to start stroking the penis towards the head position in a slow and firm stroke. Take 3 seconds to complete the stroke and wait 1 or 2 seconds at the head of the penis. Move your hand back to the starting position and repeat the milking motion. You have to perform 20 reps of this exercise. Advanced Jelking Number 2 – Girth Jelk This exercise is created to improve penis girth size. You have to start this exercise with warm-up exercise and masturbate to get a hard or nearly hard erection. You have to start this exercise by placing your hand on either side of your penis with fingers extended to the head of the penis. You have to use your hands to perform a series of squeezes where you try to bring both hands together for 60 seconds while releasing for 10 seconds. Perform 10 reps in the beginning while increasing for up to 20 reps if your comfort level permits. Complete this exercise with a cool down exercise. There are many variations of stretching and jelking exercises available over the internet. But exercises that mention above are enough to give you a stronger and bigger penis. You don't need to search around for how to get a bigger penis naturally, as everything is already mentioned on this page. By performing these exercises, you will achieve your desired penis size. Important! A note about penis pump. Let me say it loud and clear. I don't recommend penis pumps. You only need good diet and penis exercise to get a bigger penis. 
penis pumps don't add anything to this equation. Some people are more comfortable with using a pump instead of just jerking off. Or if you're also like that, then go ahead and buy a decent pump. You can replace a penis pump with jelking exercise. You have to be careful while using a penis pump, because overpumping can cause blood vessel damage, leaving your penis bruised and painful to touch. Some doctors prescribe penis pumps for the treatment of ED. If you already own a penis pump, then continue using it, but don't waste your money on buying it. Why do you need to waste money on something you don't need? However, if you're really short on time and want to achieve a bigger penis size, then I strongly recommend you to combine these exercises with stem cell therapy method mentioned inside Penis Enlargement Remedy. People who used these two methods for six months saw their penis grow by two to three inches. Penis Enlargement Routine I used this exercise routine. Week one to three. Time spent exercise per day, 15 to 20 minutes. Exercises to use. Standard stretching, standard gel. You should start with warm-up exercise. Use a warm cloth to massage surrounding areas of your penis for two to three minutes, as this will loosen up your muscles and improve blood circulation. Start with standard stretching exercise. Perform all six stretches and hold each stretch for around 30 seconds. After that, start performing standard jelking for 10 minutes, followed by cool down exercise. In the third week, perform Big Ten exercise for 10 minutes. Exercise five days a week and give yourself weekend off. You'll notice your erection becomes harder and see a little growth. Week four to five, time spent exercise per day, 15 to 20 minutes. Exercises to use, standard stretching, standard jelking, Big Ten, girth squeeze. Week six to eight, time spent exercise per day, 20 to 30 minutes. During this cycle, your body will be in the transitional stage, so you shouldn't do everything in one go. It's important to split your exercises into two sessions, one in the morning and one in the night. Start performing more advanced versions of jelk and stretches. During this period, you will start noticing results, and this period will give you a good idea about which exercise is working great on your body. It's important to mix up what you do, but keep your routine fresh for best results. Week 8. You have come far in enlarging your penis. Now, you have to get some experience about penis exercise, and you know what responded best to you. You can create your routine. Make your routine and growth will happen. Always spend at least 15 minutes a day for intense workouts. And this week, you can use stem cell therapy to enlarge your penis naturally and combine it with exercises mentioned above to get results quickly. Download Penis Enlargement Remedy now to transfer stem cells into your penis and make it grow bigger in quick time. Check link to see more. See you in the next video.